Welcome to the Mystic Runway. <laughs> Such an idiot sometimes. Um, today we're having a full English breakfast. I'm sorry for this being uh, late. In a live stream, I ordered so much Chinese. Oh, yeah, uh, I had so many. Uh, sorry for this being late. Um, on the live stream, I ordered way too much Chinese. I had so much leftovers. It is now Wednesday morning, about four o'clock in the morning, and I'm only hungry now because um, I had the Chinese Monday, and it kept me full until now, basically. Um, so I do apologize if it's been late. On Sunday, we're going live again. We're going to have Indian. I'm not going to order as much this time. I'm going to be a bit more. Um, relaxed with the order. I'll probably have two curries, a couple sides, um, some rice and yeah so I'm not going to overdo it this Sunday so if you do want to join me on Sunday then tune in 7 p.m. UK time so take a look at whichever country you're in and convert it to your time but the UK time will be 7 p.m. right I'm just going to go and get the full English breakfast it's cooking right now, and then as soon as it's finished, I'll bring you back and we'll get started. Right, we are back. I have a feast in front of me. I've got three hash browns, six sausages, two bits of bacon, mushroom, a whole tub of mushrooms, plum tomatoes, beans, fried bread, bread and butter, chips, four eggs, the eggs are hidden. <laughs> Yeah, the, the eggs didn't go so well. That's why they're hiding. Um, but yeah. Ugh. Sorry about whatever animal is making that mating call outside or whatever it's it's doing. I'm not <laughs> oh. I love homemade homemade chips. It's just the best. Mmm. Funny enough, I ordered some hash browns from Tesco. Uh, I, I ordered Tesco's own ones, and then uh, they didn't have any stock, so they sent me Aunt Betsy's. I went in the freezer to get the hash browns out now, not realizing I had some McCain ones in there already. So I've got three bags. <laughs> I've got three bags of hash browns sitting in my freezer. Oh man, today I'm drinking apple and raspberry fizzy water it's really nice I do love the fizzy water from Tesco my favourite used to be the strawberry fizzy water my favourite used to be the strawberry fizzy water um, and then it was the uh, summer fruits Summer fruits are really nice. I don't mind any of them. Really. Some of them a bit, mm. It's like a plum tomato. Who prefers... Who likes plum tomatoes or fresh grilled tomato on their breakfast I like I like um, tinned plum tomatoes personally myself don't get me wrong I'll have a free old crush I'll eat a fresh grilled tomato but I prefer whole plum tomatoes in the can
I'm not entirely sure what we're doing for Friday. <clears throat> it's either going to be something at home, so it'll either be noodles, uh, a, a, a huge ring sausage and some bower buns, because I've never had them before and I've got them in my freezer, or it might be fish and chips. From the top rated fish and chip shop which is in my area i haven't checked the prices though because i know prices have changed in takeaways now um i noticed that on <laughs> i noticed that on sunday so yeah i'm gonna take a look and see Gotta get some beans with a breakfast. Look <clears> at <throat> that sausage. Oh, Cumberland sausage. Really nice. And I think it's Tesco finest Cumberland sausages because I think there was an offer. So I thought I'd grab them. So far from the first sausage, absolutely lovely. Not as, like you don't have that, that gristle or hard fat or whatever it is inside the sausages. I've had that many, many times and it's like, ugh. Ooh. I can't go a video without dropping something on my t-shirt and the funny thing is it always seems to happen when I'm wearing white for the most part I do love mushrooms oh. I was watching um, Heather uh, eat with cold blush. She did a full English breakfast. I was like, oh man, I've got to, I've got to have a full English man. It's, oh, it's been so long. Last time I had a full English was on the channel and that's a while. And I think that I think the last full English I had on the channel was a Tesco <laughs> breakfast one. So it's not it's not proper full English, is it? And if you if if you don't make it at home, it's not really a proper one. You've got to have like a proper homemade full English breakfast. I'm not a fan personally of calf for that calf breakfast. I would eat them, don't get me wrong. But I, I, I feel like they're never like a proper sausage. They always like deep fry the sausages and stuff and it's like. Some mushrooms, some beans, some chips. Okay, maybe no chips.
There you go. So we've got a chip, and bean, and mushroom sandwich. Mm. So lovely. You can't you can't not love and filling your breakfast with a chip butty or chip chip sandwich. I bought the ketchup in, but I don't think I'm going to actually use it on this breakfast. I thought I'd have a breakfast this time without any sauces. I'll put too much salt on though, on the breakfast. That was my bad. I should have just sprinkled it on the chips and be done with it. Have some bacon. Yeah, oh, way too much salt. Damn, I messed up. Yeah, the hash browns and the fried bread, I'm not, I'm not having them. I made the mistake of doing them in, in the deep fat fryer and they just look absolutely absorbed full of oil and I'm like, mm. yeah, no. <laughs> Damn, that was a lot of salt on those chips. Well, can't believe I ruined my breakfast with all this I swear if you can see you'd be like Ugh. I don't know if you'll be able to see on this sausage how much salt is on there I don't know if you can see it really but oh god Oh wow, that, that was like a spoonful of salt. Oh, Jesus. 
Let's have an egg sandwich. Yeah, these um, eggs are really dark in yolk. I've got a uh, bluebell something. That they're the um, the blue shell on the eggs, and yeah, they're really, really orange in colour. Uh, the yolk as well. I'm gutted. I messed it up. Because normally the way I would do eggs is I would put the oil on the pan, then I'll turn the hob on. And the hob is a, a little, you know, it's an electric hob I have, so it heats up slowly. So when it starts to heat up, that's when I put the eggs in there, and then it cooks a bit slower. If I put the egg, like if I put the, let the hob heat up first, Then put the pan on and crack the egg straight away. It's already bubbling up too fast, so the eggs just don't come out. Like, like a, you know, you know, like a children's toy. You get those eggs, like them. Uh, I, I, that's how I want my egg to come out. But yeah, no, it came out like bubbly all over, and it just didn't. Yeah, it just didn't cook properly. I guess. Well, it cooks. It cooks. It's fully cooked, but <laughs> you know. But oh, I can't believe I, I've, I've literally ruined my breakfast. That bacon should be right to eat, because that was underneath, I think. Plain, same as that plain tomato and the rest of the mushrooms. But yeah, one, one, two, three, three of the sausages are smothered in salt. So I'll probably sort them out later and put them in some bread for a sandwich, because I asked my sister to get me two slices of bread. That's all I really wanted was two slices. She got me a whole loaf. I don't eat bread, so I've got to find something to do with them. I've got no room in my freezer to freeze them either. So, oh. It's nice bread though. Marks and Spencer's bread. Only 75 pence for a bag. You know, and people moan about Marks and Spencer being expensive. That's cheaper than Hovis. Yeah, I think next time I make a full English, I'm just going to shallow fry the bread and not put it in a deep fat fryer. I don't know why I did that, man. That is so stupid of me. Because it, that's going to absorb all the oil. Whereas if you shallow fry it and just put a bit of oil in there, it's not absorb it was absorb it, but because you've only put a, oil, <laughs> a little bit of oil in there, it's not as bad. But yeah, when you deep fry it, it's like... Bleh. That's another thing I don't like about the calves is I've never had, um, what do you call it? Uh, I can't even remember what they call it. Fried bread? Is that fried bread? <laughs> but yeah, that, that's, that's why I don't like them um, from the calf because they do that. And I don't know why I did that. I was just being lazy.
well, <clears throat> what I will do is in the beginning of the video, I will leave in the part where I'm putting the salt on there and you can see how much salt I put on there. I just didn't, weren't even paying attention, um, really. I mean, you probably see in the beginning how much salt I put on, it's like, wow. Yeah. <coughs> <coughs> Don't worry, the food will be rescued. The sausages will be wiped down. <coughs> to get as much salt off as possible. And the eggs will be reused for a sandwich as well, probably tonight. Hence it being like five o'clock in the morning. Uh, you know, <laughs> as, you, as you could probably hear with the birds in the background making noises. <clears throat> I guess they've just woken up. It's, it, it's nice, don't you? <laughs> I like it, I like, sometimes I like it, it's peaceful, like, to go on the balcony and you can just hear the birds singing away and it's, it's so lovely, you know. Sometimes it's, this sauce just, I think is okay. Oh my. I've been waiting for this for such a long time and I've decided to ruin it. Come on, man. And I, see, this is why I didn't want to put ketchup on because I didn't want to, uh, <laughs> I didn't want to overshadow the flavor. I just wanted to taste everything as it was because it's the first time I've had these sausages, first time I've had these eggs and everything and I just, yeah. That's my mistake, man. That's all on me. Um, if if you've seen from the beginning and you haven't watched it all through yet and you've already put a message on there like, my God, that's a lot of salt, yeah. I, 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 was, I was in my own mind when I was pouring the salt and yeah, that was disgustingly too much salt. But yeah, I mean, some of you would be saying in the comments like, why don't you wipe down the stuff now and eat it? And I just, I just don't want to sit there and start, you know, messing about with the food and stuff, man. I'm just, plus I'm, I'm, I'm yeah, I can literally taste all the salt on my lips and everything. It's... Thank you guys for watching. I do apologize for this video. Tune in again Friday where I won't make that mistake again. <laughs>